Hello guys, this is Shraddha and today we are going to fix keyboard keys which are not working on laptop keyboard. Yeah, so for very first you can see the ease option over here. So just click on that and you will see the on screen keyboard. So just attach the external mouse. And by touch, if your touchpad is not working, you can just use the external mouse or you can just click on that ease option and just click on on screen keyboard so that you can use it. For very first, what you do, so I'll going, I'm going to tell you the three methods, top three methods by which you can fix this issue. Yeah, so for very first, what you will just click on the start menu and after that just click on settings so after that just go to update and security so here you check for the updates that are you up to date Because many times this issue happens due to update because we don't regularly update our window. Yeah, for me it is up to date. So just check for updates and install the updates. So here you can see the troubleshoot option. Just click on troubleshoot. So here you can see additional troubleshooters. Just click on additional troubleshooters. So here you can see keyboard option. So just click on keyboard. Click on run troubleshooter. Yeah, so it will detect the issues and it will solve your issue. Yeah, so it has been completed and there is, you can see the detailed information for it. That there was no issue present. And in my PC, there is no issue. So it is showing no issue present. In your PC, it will show what exactly the issue is. Yeah, so you can just close it. Yeah, so this was the first method. I'll tell you the second method. So here in the settings, go to ease of access. After that, just scroll down. You can see this keyboard option. Just click on this keyboard. After this, you can just check for the filter keys. Scroll down. Here you can see the use filter keys. If it is enabled, just disable it. If it is disabled, just enable it. So I'll just disable it. So just go in ease of access. Then again, click on keyboard section. Here you can see use your device without a physical keyboard you can just on it so that you can use it by this way yeah so this was the second method by which your issue will be solved Now I will tell you the third most method which will definitely solve your issue. So just click on start and type device manager. So just open the device manager.
check for keyboard check for keyboards yeah so just expand this keyboard after that click on this keyboard right click it and update the driver just click on update the driver so click on search automatically for driver just close it again close it again open device manager just go to keyboards expand the keywords just click on the standard just right click and update the driver click on update the driver and you can just select browse my computer for drive just click on that after that click over here let me pick from the list after that click this standard ps just click on next yeah so it will be updated and it will ask to restart your computer just restart your computer and if it do, you can try uninstalling the driver and also you can just update the windows and restart your computer so that definitely the issue will be solved okay then that's all for this video if you like the video please give the like and share it with your friends if you have any questions then comment below i'll respond you back okay then take care bye bye